All right, we're going to do the unboxing of this observation hive here. Check it out. Let's see what's in here. Getting ready for spring. I like to get stuff ready. So let's check it out. This is, uh, I believe this is the award-winning observation hive design. I got this one from Daynot. I think you can get it from several different places. I'll give you the information in the description below. Oh, it's all one piece. All right, let's see what it's all about. All right. Looks like we can see that pretty good. The thing I like about this observation hive is that it holds a five frame nuke in this bottom box. And I run a lot of my hives as five frame nukes and then 10 for overwintering. And so I can just place one of these in here, let it grow, bring my frames up into this part for the farmer's market and uh, display my bees. And then uh, put it back together. So let's see what we got down here. We got, uh, looks like we got a screen bottom board. And uh, they even threw in a little mic count. A little mic count board. It's kind of nice. Couch your mites. There's a place where you open it up so they can come in and out. On the top here. This is where you pop this up. Put your uh, frame up here to be displayed. And uh, there's a screen uh, queen excluder in there between these pieces. Let's pull this apart and see if you can see that. See that queen excluder there? So once you put her in the top, she won't be able to get back down. Or if you don't want uh, her up there, if she's laying and you want her down on the bottom, you can keep her down there and you can just. Uh, display the worker bees doing their thing and the way you do that is you unscrew this somehow it's been a long time since I looked at this I've been wanting it for a while I guess you have to unscrew it all the way you pull that out and reveal the bee frame inside there with the uh, of plastic same thing on the other side so the people can see it from both sides and uh, I'm planning on using this at the farmers market uh, to generate more interest in people coming to the booth keep people there longer educate people about bees kids get kids interested in them and so that's kind of the idea with this observation hive I've been uh, wanting one of these for a while um, these are the uh, ventilations, and I believe you can uh, pop one of these out and feed them uh, with a bottle of syrup or something like that. I'll have to look. I don't remember exactly how you feed them with this one, but there's a whole, I think there's a whole setup. It didn't come with anything in the box. I didn't see anything, but I think there's directions. I don't know if it's online or what. I do like these little suitcase latches also, they're pretty nice, so everything is sealed up pretty nice. Got this uh, foam up here to seal that out to make sure that no bees can get out and uh, scare the public. You know, if you're in a public place, you don't want bees flying around and uh, scaring people. Uh, I know they shouldn't be scared of them, but some people are because they're not familiar with them, so that's a nice little feature there. 
and this is a uh, you know that's very tight on here and uh, ventilation so the bees can ventilate this obviously you don't want to put this in direct sun because that even uh, they won't be able to ventilate that much but with the screen bottom board and that they'll be able to keep this uh, pretty nice as long as you keep it out of the direct sun and uh, so that's the uh, observation hive this kind where you put the display frame on top I uh, hope you enjoyed checking this out and uh, I'll put more information about this uh, in the description and uh, when I'm using it I'll put some more videos up about that and thanks for watching